I just wanted to talk for a moment about faith. Faith is uh, very important, and um, a lot of people don't realize how important faith is in life. Uh, sometimes uh, life is really bad, and you have to uh, find the good in life. And sometimes the good in life isn't obviously apparent. So you have to f have faith that you will find the good in life at some point. Have faith that you will find the the dream you once had, the dream you still have. You think about things that are real, that are possible, that can happen to anyone. You think about what is what is the dream come true. You think about what is the wish you made. What are the wishes you make on a daily basis? What is the prayer you said last night? What did you pray for? What do you pray for on a nightly basis? What do you pray for? What do you wish for? Do you have faith? Do you have optimism? Do you believe dreams can come true? Do you believe anything can happen? Or do you think there's limits to life? There's limits to what is possible and what's not possible. And maybe your dreams can't come true. That's something that happens to a lot of people. A lot of people live their entire lives and their dreams never come true. A lot of people live their entire lives and their dreams never come true. And that's a real possibility. It's a real possibility that you could live your life that way and that's something real. That's something real you've got to face head on. The possibility that your dreams might not ever come true. And there's a life to be lived if that happens. There's still a way to move forward, a way to move on, a way to still believe in something. Even if your faith is irrelevant, even if nothing really matters, there's still a way to move forward. Because even homeless people have a reason to live. Homeless people might have faith, but their dreams probably didn't come true. But they still have faith that their world can change, that their world can be turned upside down, that their world can be completely changed around. Completely changed around. And that's faith. Is when not having any evidence of anything good ever going to happen. But you dream. You dream it. And you see it in your dream. You don't see it anywhere else. You don't you don't see it on a daily on a day to day basis. You don't see it in your room. You don't see it in your house. You don't see it in your world, but you see it in your dreams. The dream is always the same. The dream is always the same. So you have faith because you've seen it in your dreams. Okay, that's what faith is. It is when you see something not in reality but in your fantasy. And you have to keep that in the front of your mind because if sometimes if you lose track of it, you will lose your reason to live. And you have to maintain your reason to live, even if it's irrational, even if it's unlikely, even if it's impossible, you still have to maintain your faith. Because if you lose your faith, and you lose your reason to live, you lose your will to live, you lose everything. If you lose your faith, you lose everything. So you can't lose your faith. You keep on, you keep it, you hold on to it, you never let go. You never let go of your faith, no matter how much it falls, no matter if you lose your grasp on it, or... It starts to you start to lose your grasp on the faith or the, your understanding of that reality. 
your understanding of that possibility. You consider it. You consider the a scenario where your dream could come true. And, and let me tell you something else about faith. Faith is about believing in something when you don't see it in front of you. Faith is like a ghost, right? You don't see a ghost. You might feel like you're a ghost sometimes, but you know a ghost is there somewhere behind you, somewhere floating above you. It's a ghost. Somewhere floating around is a ghost. Faith is knowing that, that that ghost is there and letting it be, just letting it just float around. And I don't know, I'm running out of ideas here, but just basically thinking your dreams can come true. And it's, and, and it's irrational. That's the other the point I'm trying to make is faith is irrational by very definition. If your faith was rational, then everybody would have it, right? If your faith is rational, then everybody would, would have it. Everybody doesn't have faith. Some people have lost their faith. Some people have lost that part of them that makes them believe. And, okay. You know, they've, they don't have it. They don't have it. Um, they don't have the same wishes, the same dreams. It's just different, you know? For some people, it's just different. Um, but I'm rambling now. I'm rambling now. And I just wanted to say, never lose your faith, no matter what anybody tells you. No matter what happens to you in your life, okay? And I'm not talking about Christian faith, I'm not talking about Hindu faith, I'm not talking about Islam faith, I'm not talking about Buddha, I'm not talking about uh, Muhammad, not Muhammad, I'm not talking about, what, what's the name? Whatever, um, I'm not talking about Allah, I'm not talking about God, I'm not talking about any, I'm not talking about faith in God, I'm talking about faith in anything. Could be a God. Could be talking about faith in God. If, if that's where you find your meaning, good. Faith in God. But, I mean, faith in yourself. Faith in everyone around you. Faith in the world. Faith in the secular world. Faith in the unsecular world. Faith in fairy tales. Faith in, faith in romance novels. Faith in um, your health improving so you don't have a runny nose anymore. You've had the same runny nose since you were a little kid. Faith that you could get healthier. Faith that you could find romance. Faith that anything could happen. And that's what that's what life's about. That's what life's about is faith in anything at all. You can pick anything in the world to have faith in. And that's real. That's whatever you choose to have faith in. If it's real to you, it's real. You can pick anything you want. You can pick a movie. Uh, a fictional character, a Disney character, a uh, character from a Warner Brothers TV show, from a cartoon. You can read it in a book. You can write it in a letter. It can go anywhere. Your faith can go anywhere. It can come from anywhere. If, if you get it from Christianity, good. Good for you. If you get it from Christianity, if you get it from Islam, good for you. I don't choose to get it from a religion. Okay, I have faith... Not from in a religion, but in a humanity itself, and in um, humanism, and the beauty all around us, and faith in the sky, and the sun, the clouds, the wind, the rain, the storms, the hills, the, the, the wonderment of the world is where I get faith. Let me know in the comments below, do you have faith, and what does faith mean to you? Let me know in the comments below, what does faith mean to you? Um, thank you for watching and you can please subscribe to this channel to be part of the community please like this video it really helps the channel out a lot
Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Keep the faith.